Welcome everybody, my name is Michael and today we see something crazy. Dogecoin has hit number 5. Because if we look at market cap, yes we have hit number 5. And Bitcoin is back down below 61,000. Ethereum hit 2,500 and went way above. And now it's way below. Binance coin was just below 500. XRP is down. But as you can see, Dogecoin is up 520%. And it's up 188% over the past 24 hours. It actually hit over 200% over the past 24 hours. And this was over 600%, almost 100% every single day for the past week because of a lot of celebrity pumping, Mark Cuban, and just overall general hype about Dogecoin, even when the rest of the market isn't doing as well, still rising to all new time highs, price discovery for a lot of these. There's a lot of people happy about this one little meme coin, which is absolutely insane. If you put in money earlier, a thousand bucks, only have five, six thousand dollars, not bad whatsoever. And Polkadot and Cardano were kind of moved out a little bit, which is kind of funny. But all right, that's the way she blows. So let's discuss about Dogecoin, whose all-time high hit 43 cents point 77. Why is it continuing to rise even though Bitcoin, Ethereum, Binance Coin, XRP, Cardano, Polkadot, basically everything's down a few percent. Of course, don't get me wrong, this was just climbing not too long ago, but if we look at the past seven days, Dogecoin, number one, nothing comes even close, which is absolutely crazy, and over the past 24 hours, again, Nothing comes even close. Verge is doing all right. You know, Theta's doing all right. But nothing's close to Dogecoin. That is absolutely insane. So let's get right into it. Mark Cuban one-ups Elon Musk. Mavs to hold Dogecoin on their balance sheet. They pulled in 112,000 Doge in sales after supporting the meme coin in March. And they're holding on to it. So if we take... Let's just say 40 cents currently. It's not a lot. It's $44,800. But if Dogecoin would hypothetically get to a dollar, that would be equal to $112,000, which is still a sizable portion for something that's a complete meme coin for a company to be getting onto this. Obviously, it's going to help with marketing because, hey, you have this multi-billionaire who's the owner of the Dallas Mavericks who's suddenly coming in, yeah, I support Dogecoin. Coin, and then you have Elon Musk, who, as always, is tweeting about Dogecoin. There we go. You have one meme, and then he's talking about SpaceX and posting other memes and who going to the moon. Which, by the way, the going to the moon part, I'm not sure if that's not in reference to Dogecoin or Bitcoin or something like that, because his whole plan is Mars, obviously. Hmm. Well, then here we go. Doge barking at the moon. So stuff like this where you get 283,000 people like this. You have millions of people who saw this tweet. Millions of people who saw this. 46,000 retweeted it. And this was yesterday. So within the past 24 hours, right? You have a lot of stuff going on. I mean, Elon Musk's approaching 52 million followers. Mark Cuban also has millions and millions of followers and <laughs> this is just crazy. So if we go to Twitter, we see that for how crazy Doge has been today, Chabath, Elon Musk, and Mark Cuban have been really quiet. And another one responded, none of them want to be investigated, so they're letting the organic pub do its thing, which is great. And here's what Mark Cuban tweeted. For your information, the Mav sales of Dogecoin have increased over 550%. Woohoo, I guess. <laughs> if we go to his Twitter profile, there we go, Mark Cuban, that's right, 8.2 million followers just on Twitter, and he's crazy about NFTs, he's crazy about Dogecoin, he's crazy about Bitcoin, Ethereum, yeah, he is also a big power player where just a single tweet is enough to move markets. 
Dogecoin spikes 300% in a week, stoking fears of a cryptocurrency bubble, CNBC. Now defying all odds, Dogecoin is worth $34 billion. Well, yeah, now it's worth even more. It's worth 40, almost $50 billion. And it was worth more because it was worth 40 cents above. So that's pretty crazy. Then you have much wow. Slim Jim has a Dogecoin strategy. News of it sends Doge to new all-time high. By the way, Oh my goodness, I have to say, it's my guilty pleasure. I love Slim Jim. I miss Slim Jim. They're nowhere to be seen in Europe. I haven't been able to find anybody who's importing them when I come back to the States. Oh, I just can't wait to get my hands on a Slim Jim. Slim Jim and Monster Energy, that's what I always love to pair. Now, I can't obviously take caffeine because of my tinnitus, but Slim Jim, I miss it. And my dog also, Mo. <laughs> he also liked to eat some Slim Jims when I was eating Slim Jims. But anyways, the social media savvy snack food saw its Twitter follower count increase 160% and tweet impressions soared to the moon 35 million impressions in 25 days after it began engaging in Shibu Inu meme coin content last quarter, according to the CEO. We've seen a marked uptick in audience interaction, including direct engagement and advocacy from the person who created Dogecoin. Nice. So that's pretty cool. And Connolly said Slim Jim's community is built on memes, which as it happens is Dogecoin's base too. The Dogecoin army relentlessly pumps its favorite crypto with memes on memes. Since March, some of these memes have come from Slim Jim. Slim Jim's Twitter account told Coindesk the brand has built up a rapport with crypto fans to get to this point. The, tw the Twitter family around Doge engaged with us early March. We're excited about this and you should be on the lookout for additional crypto themed activations in the future. And here we are. Our Slim Jim on Twitter is posting Doge collaborating with Slim Jim benefiting World Central Kitchen on April 20th. I wonder why they chose that date. That's a rather hmm, interesting date. <laughs> Sure, they may not be huge, but everybody's heard of Slim Jim, at least if you're an American. Uh, they've got 75,000 followers, and look at that. Look at that. That's that's. Wow, that's great brand support. So whoever is one of the lead marketers at Slim Jim probably got a nice promotion because uh, this is actually kind of a fun job. Like, think about it. You're working for a corporation and you're like, well, you know what? How can we promote our tasty, meaty treats? And then you think, well, there's this Doge meme and hey, there's this cryptocurrency behind it and it's worth billions. Let's, let's just do memes. Let's just post a bunch of memes and it's working. <laughs> <laughs> That's just, um, all right. Well, hey, I, I have to be honest. Doges do like Slim Jims. My German Shepherd was a big fan of Slim Jims, although I'm sh pretty sure that's not too healthy, but, you know. Uh, he's he's not with us anymore. He died with cancer, but that's, you know, he enjoyed himself while he ate some Slim Jims, and they've got a fair amount of meaty treats to choose from, but uh, dang, that's just, just constant doge on doge on doge memes. And then welcome to the Telegraph, where I can't even view anything, but... Uh, Robinhood hid claims of restricting Dogecoin amid rally. Well, this that's what it was supposed to be, and then... I'm not able to accept whatever. Ah, my goodness, I don't care about the free one month trial. But yes, Dogecoin is potentially limited yet again, thanks to Robinhood. So I don't even know why people are using Robinhood at this point anymore. It's just crazy. Billionaire Mark Cuban says he will never sell one Dogecoin. Here's why. Dogecoin will definitely hit a dollar. That's that's a big pump tweet right there on March 6, 2021, if I ever saw one. Dogecoin is less than a dime, literally, and I say this with all seriousness. It's the best entertainment bag for your buck available. That's not to say it has any intrinsic value. It doesn't, but so what? It gives you a better chance of winning than a lottery ticket, all while teaching the economics of supply and demand and introducing people to crypto assets. That's kind of crazy. I never thought Mark Cuban would really get it on this but uh hey you also have a bay area restaurant begins accepting cryptocurrency doge now accepting dogecoin i'm sure you're gonna have more and more of these local businesses that are gonna be accepting dogecoin alongside their other cryptocurrency payments options so uh pretty cool stuff honest uh honest day's work for dogecoin we've got multi-billionaires tweeting about it it hit number five and uh yeah pretty good day's work for april so that's today's dogecoin update i guess <laughs>
<laughs> yep, it finally moved up to number five. There we go. But uh, now, since it's moving down, it actually has to go back down to number six. Well, that's just how it works. It's a little bit of a delay. In the last video, I was talking about this guy. Yeah, this guy's probably super excited. He's like the only Dogecoin, fully Dogecoin channel I could think of. Yeah, 37.7 thousand subscribers. Look, look at this. Look at this. Yeah, just straight up Dogecoin. He's been talking about Dogecoin for uh, quite a while. <laughs> <laughs> That's absolutely crazy. So, hey, he's uh, found his niche and community. So that's great. Congratulations. So thanks for watching today's video. If you enjoyed it, hit that subscribe button. Please leave a like, comment, and share because that helps every piece of engagement for our channel to grow. We have hit over 770 subscribers. Hopefully we're able to get to 800 pretty soon. And with May approaching, these are my last few weeks before I fly back to America. So hopefully we're able to get to two uploads per day. I've been trying a little bit. It's been working out well. So thanks for watching. See you guys tomorrow as always. Always. Bye.